Hey guys, so today I wanted to show you how I make my Thieves laundry soap. Um, so I have the laundry soap right here and it's highly concentrated so um, I'm making it into three parts but putting it in this um, so I can just put it right in the dispenser. So keep watching. Okay, so first I'm going to add in the laundry soap. So you can do this in three separate containers. Um, that's what most people do, but I just wanted to put it in one big one just to make it easier. Okay, so next we're going to do six capfuls of the Thieves cleaner. Um, and if you were doing this in three parts, obviously you just do two capfuls in each one. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and do six. Okay, so I just put six capfuls in there and now I'm going to put 10 drops of lemon. Okay, so for this next part, you just fill it up with water. Um, so I'm going to put probably about five cups in there and then I'll mix it up and I'll let you know how it looks. Okay, so now we just mix it up. We have the water in there and you can see how much bigger it is. It's still a pretty thick consistency. Um, so you don't have to dilute this if you don't want to, but you'll just use like a super, super, super small amount that it's almost hard to use such a small amount. So um, it's really nice if you just dilute it and then that way you can be more generous with the amount that you put in. It's also nice to dilute it because if someone uses it and doesn't realize that you're only supposed to use a tiny, tiny amount, then it's not like super soapy in the washer and it's not like you're, you're losing a ton of the product. Um, and then also I wanted to say that you can also save this label and put it on whatever container you're using. Um, some people like to divide it out in pump bottles and then they put this label on it. Um, or by you can save these bottles and then once you get like about three of these then you can start putting them back in here and just using that if you want. But I kind of like having this little nozzle. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and that it helped you and you learned something. Let me know if you want to try this too and I'll get you set up um, or if you have any questions on how to do it. Thanks guys. Just show you guys um, why I like this because you can just pull this out and then pull the nozzle and fill it up and you're all done.